Uh, you know, Caroline, uh, I guess Kamala Harris's new motto is when the polls go low, we go lower. Your reaction to just the really increased horrible vitriol that we're hearing from her and others in the last few weeks especially. Well, it's despicable to hear this inflammatory rhetoric rhetoric coming from Kamala Harris. This rhetoric is three things. First, it is dangerous. These This is the type of words that led to two heinous assassination attempts on President Trump's life. Secondly, this rhetoric is divisive. Kamala Harris and Hillary Clinton and the Democrat Party are insulting the intelligence of tens of millions of Americans who support President Trump by suggesting that they would actually support a fascist or someone likened to Hitler. It's absurd. And thirdly, this rhetoric is dishonest. Kamala Harris and the Democrats know that these attacks against President Trump aren't true. That's why three Democrats in blue wall states are currently running advertisements right now, cozying up to President Trump with positive rhetoric about him because they know that they need uh, him to win. And President Trump is more popular amongst the American people today than he ever has been since 2016. This is the type of language that they've been using against him for eight years. But the polls show Americans aren't buying it. They remember how much better their lives were under President Trump. We already had him for president for four years. Our democracy was stronger than it is today under Kamala Harris. It's a very poor and negative and disturbing negative uh, closing message coming from the Kamala campaign. But I'll tell you, our closing message, Rita, is a winning one. It's Kamala Harris broke our border. She broke our economy. She broke our standing in this world. And only President Trump can fix it. And I'll humbly say I think that message is working because President Trump is leading in every single battleground state right now and clearly has the momentum on his side.